we just increase efficiency by over half. Uh, let's give it something appropriate. Human rights violation. Hey yo, what the f I think it's time we finally go to that mechanator lair. I think we were supposed to go like uh two episodes ago. <laughs> it's only like it's less than a day away too. All right, let's grab Van, David. Uh, we'll grab Moshinto. I think three people should be enough. Is this it? David's gonna go first. So we got David going in first. Moshinto's gonna cover our flanks. And Van's gonna take up the rear. I feel like I'm playing XCOM. Open that. Great. Go attack him. Uh, you guys didn't even help. Mechanator casket found. Let's see what else is here. I'm also getting ambushed. That's it. I'm getting ambushed by one Militor. <laughs> yeah, I think I should have been here like long ago. You know what I figured out the other day? Don't care. Remember when I was complaining about these really uh, stupid jeans that I got from people? For example, Tinder skin. And then I noticed the, uh, the metabolic efficiency. You see, the metabolic efficiency figures out how much food you must eat, right? So if you make a really shitty gene pack and give it to someone, they're going to eat less. Which is actually perfect for my prisoners. What a wonderful idea. So we're going to make them uh, psychically deaf. Why not give them poor social skills? Make them nearsightedness. Yeah, we're going to give them some extra fire damage. We just increase efficiency by over half. Oh, Xenotype name. Uh, let's give it something appropriate. Human rights violation. That's made with passion. Ah, uh, you can select the icons, huh? Let's make it a skull, simply because these guys will be uh, starving. Or actually, no, I should make it a fat one because I'm slowing down their metabolism. Nice and round face. That represents diabetes. Excellent. I'm sure my prisoners will appreciate this. Check out my new mech. Looks amazing. That guy's a tunneler. Oh, guess what I got? The human rights violation xenogerm. <laughs> we'll give it to uh, Haziv first. All right, buddy. Here's some human rights violation. All right, let's make another one. Uh, let's call this the uh, CCP. Bruh. I'm going to save the template. I'm going to make a few of these. This is no longer a prison cell anymore. This is my uh, my re-education camp. The CCP is finished. Let's give this to Daniel. All right, man. Let's uh, re-educate Daniel into the CCP, huh? Beautiful. Look at that. Oh, shit. It's a fucking mech raid. I think we can take him. Oh shit, I forgot to build a door here. Yeah, David, you might need to activate this. Yeah, right there. Oh my god, it destroyed everything. Holy shit. Thank god I built a fucking rocket launcher, huh? This mad wild boar is gonna attack my tunneler? Are you stupid? You are gonna be dinner. Oh, these guys are chilling in my kill box. Quickly. Yo, Joshua. This is a perfect time to summon another Diabolus threat. Oh, I hope they get here before these guys leave. This is extra manpower, man. That's free. Oh, no. My friends are leaving. The boss is not here yet. Yo, slow down, boys. I gotta do this earlier next time. Maybe when they immediately enter the map. Oh, Hump's got a Mega Slot. I forgot about that. That Mega Slot is tanking the fucking hits for them, man. What the hell? Is, uh, is this Mega Slot gonna be okay, bro? <laughs> Holy shit. That fucking mega slot took more damage from us than the enemy. Oh, you know what I forgot to build, bro? I forgot to build the uh, fire foam poppers, man. Shit, boy. What was that saying? Prior preparation leads to results. Sun Tzu, probably. Oh, we got another tree caravan. Quickly, Joshua, summon another Diabolus threat. Hopefully these guys stick around this time. We don't want to waste all that extra help, you know what I'm saying? Oh, hang on. They're not even going to my kill box. Yo, boys, please. I'm standing in my kill box. Man! Another one of these waste fucking quests. I kind of want this times five death rest capacity though. Shit, boy. Fuck it. Give it to me. I guess we'll keep adding to this gigantic fucking waste pollution pile on the bottom. <laughs> I think it'll be fine. Even if everything's polluted on the outside, it's gonna be green on the inside. Oh, Death Ball became an adult. Really? This guy's only 13. How he... <laughs> he became an adult at 13? Oh man, Rimworld does not fuck around. Dude, I was still a dumbass when I was 13. Pyromaniac, definitely don't want that. Jealous, that's fucking useless. Yeah, we're just gonna go with, uh... Oh, we can make him a psychopath. It's not that helpful, to be honest. I don't have enough psychopath in my colony anymore. We started with three, but we still only have three. So I feel like I can't do the shit that psychopath would do anyways. Let's just make him a fast learner. All right, boys. Let's do this. What the fuck? 
Man, they're getting real serious about this now, huh? An ultra heavy mech with a built-in shield bubble generator. Jesus, man. Yo, nerf this fucking thing. What the hell? Hit him. Oh, David, run away. Hit him now. Hit this guy. Yes, don't let him shoot. Oh my god, that shield lasts forever. Holy fuck. Oh, run away. I think he's gonna blow up. Oh, yep. Yeah. What a mess. <laughs> my bad. We'll just let the uh, turrets get rid of the last dude. Ah, there we go. That was uh, pretty good. Look at all the fucking cum everywhere. What? See, man, we learn from our mistakes. Oh my lord. That is a lot of infestation coming out. That pollution ball sack is sure attracting a lot of bugs. I gotta stop taking people's trash. <laughs> this is our kill box 2.0. It's gonna come with more turrets. 16 times the detail. Some big turrets at the back. And even more space for my colonists to shoot out of. And by comparison, this is our original kill box. It has served us very well. But now it is time for an upgrade. The cocoons are opening. What did you do? Jesus, man. Not allowed. Don't touch that shit. Oh, that was my bad. Oh, shit. Look at them. Oh, and they're kill. Oh, okay. That was a unwanted benefit, but I'll take it. <laughs> I had a defoliator ship here that was uh, fucking on my map, but uh, I guess these guys can just kill each other. Oh, thanks, guys. Oh, boy. Oh, they're inside. That's not good. Oh, Jesus. Infestation. Yo, it better not break my fucking gene bank. It broke my gene bank. Oh, God. There's so many of them. Oh, Jesus. There's more in there. <laughs> Holy fuck. Polly, my bad. All right, that's one group. Almost taken care of. Oh, my God. These infestations, man. What the fuck? Bro, 71? The whole fucking squad is here. Look at them, man. What the fuck? My, uh, my new kill bot is not even ready yet. David, let's go kite them a little bit, huh? Can't touch this, man. Can't touch this. Hey, you want some of this? Yo, come get some of this. <laughs> Stupid beavers. Oh, that beaver almost made it. Well, okay. That was a massacre. I guess we're having beaver meat for dinner. Our new kill box is about to be finished. I think we're ready for bigger challenges. Let's summon that war queen, huh? One war queen, five pikemen, and two scyther. Easy work. All right, interesting looking enemy. Let's see what she's packing. She can deploy a combat max. Oh, these are the small things. Shred them, kill them, kill the war queen. Oh my god, I'm getting raided right now. Can you guys, like, relax? Wait a minute, where are these guys going? Oh, Jesus. They're actually getting smart about this. I didn't think they were actually gonna go from the side, man. What the hell? Oh, it's because this thing's not open. Whoops. Oh, no. They're here. Urban warfare, motherfucker. Get them. Oh, they're running away. Got myself another one of these, uh, subcore scanner things. This one's called a rip scanner. Hmm. Destroying the brain in the process. I feel like that kills them. Jesus. I guess getting one of these heavy mechs is gonna take some work. Uh. Oh, what the fuck? I got a quest where uh, these sanguifages come to my place to have a secret meeting and uh, looks kind of crazy what they're doing, huh? Y'all better not be summoning shit. I was thinking of kidnapping one of them, but they're all kind of terrible. Like, this one hates men, this one's ugly. I didn't even think that was possible for uh, one of these vampires. And this one doesn't like women. I wonder what these two are talking about, huh? One hates women and one hates men. <laughs> ah, perfect timing. I was looking for some new prisoners, man. These uh, new subcores ain't gonna build themselves, you know? Hey, kite them. <laughs> Take their fire. Oh, shit. My fucking turrets. Oh, these guys are so annoying, man. Leave my turrets alone, dude. Don't let them run away. Shoot them. Welcome to Blood Creek. All right, let's capture some of these fools. I need to make myself some new uh, high quality subcores. My man here is getting shredded. That's what happens when you evade me, bro. Very nice. Please come again. I think this is a good time to end this week's episode. My base has come along very well. Next time, I'm going to build up our robotic army. And uh, my prisoners, they're all part of the CCP now. <laughs> Daniel's part of CCP, so is Fiona. And uh, Hazib here, uh, he still got his human rights violation. He's a pioneer of the CCP. I've started building my spaceship. This thing needs a lot of parts, actually. But uh, yeah, once I have that built, we'll finally launch off of this uh, godforsaken place, this Rimworld. And uh, maybe, you know, go out there into space and find God again. Atone for our sins, you know? 
<laughs> if you enjoyed this video, please consider hitting the like button and subscribing to the channel. Till next time.